All right, this is my take from my estate sale that I went to today. I only did comps on a couple things. Comps mean comparison pricing to see if they're worth anything. And these marble, these are marble coasters from wineries. And they sell on eBay for 20 bucks uh, for a set of four. So, and they're really heavy because they're real marble. So I will not be putting these on eBay because by the time we do shipping, it, I don't think it'd be worth it. So I think I'm going to take these. I'm either going to take them to the flea market or give them as a gift to somebody because they. I only paid two fifty for the four, two dollars and fifty cents. I did good on that. That was fun. Okay, and so then I bought each of these. I think I paid seventy five cents for each tumbler. Yeah, I paid seventy five cents for each of these tumblers. And comps are um, about $20 a piece on eBay. I may try to sell these on eBay just because they're so lightweight. And I think with the shipping, it might be worth it. So I may put these on eBay and see. If I don't, I'll put them in the flea market for like $10, $10 or $12 and see if they'll sell. Because um, a lot of people that do vintage, these are like 80s, 80s Disney the S, they say Super 22 down here. I don't know if you can see that. Super 22. These are like 80s mugs from Disney World. So they're collector's items, I guess. See, I can do this. I can go to estate sales and get stuff that's worth money. Now this stuff, everything that's marked on here was 50 cents off because I went on a Sunday. So... Yay me, this huge mug, which I think is just adorable because of all the, um, because of all the painting on it and it's huge and everybody loves a huge mug for, for winter time. I'm going to sell this at my, at the flea market and I bought it for 50 cents. So I'll probably sell it for $5 or something cute. I got this little, um, I need to see what the comp is on this, this little penguin tin. It's from West Germany, made in West Germany. It might be worth something, I don't know. If it is, I might put that on eBay. We'll see. These I paid 50 cents for. These are just basic cups. They're not worth anything. You can tell they're not worth anything based on what's on the bottom. You can get these at Target. They're made in China, not worth anything, but they're nice cups. So I'll probably charge like 250 or something for them. Really cute. And then I got this set for $2.50. All five of these glasses were um, $2.50, $2.50 for the set. Um, I think these were a little nicer brand, but they also were made in China, so they aren't worth anything. So I will um, probably sell these at the flea market for like $5 for the set, or may even go more and go $6 or $7. I don't know. And then I got this uh, shell frame. For a dollar. I have to look that up and see if it's worth anything. I don't think it is. So probably sell it for like five at the flea market. And then I got this one. I may keep this one. It's cute. I paid half price for that. I paid like a dollar fifty, I think, for that one. So super cute. So I I my whole my expenses today were $13 for everything. And um, if if I sell these four and these three, that's 20, 40, 60, 80. And then the little bit that I would get for that. So that's a good haul. We'll see if they actually sell. Now, I always watch these on YouTube. I watch other resellers. And, you know, I always think, well, that's great if you resell it. You have to resell it first to actually make any money. So I'm just trying, trying it to see how I do. So we'll see. I still think these would make great gifts for somebody. And you deliver them to them. You don't ship them because they're so heavy, but they're real marble, so they're really cute. And I know a lot of people that drink wine, so these would be really neat gifts. So that's probably what's gonna happen to those. But if I take these to the flea market, they'll probably, I'll probably only put like, I don't know, $8 a piece on them. And, um, Somebody who actually collects them will know that they're actually worth 20 retail. And they might buy them. I don't know. They might not. So who knows? I don't know. 
might put them on eBay just to see if I can sell them. All right, so that's my fun estate haul. I did learn something today. Don't go to estate sales on Saturday. Always go on Sunday when everything is half off. But then you miss all the good stuff, I suppose, because a lot was picked over. So I don't know. That was my, my lesson. I had fun, though. So this was my estate pull in today. We'll see how it goes. I'll have it out on my um, flea market next month and I'll share it with you guys how that goes. Thanks for watching. Please hit that subscribe button and subscribe to my channel. Thank you.